Hello people, here is an amazing question for you to solve. We have a circle here with O as the center and AB and CD as perpendicular diameters. Let P be a point anywhere on the circumference of the circle. We draw perpendicular line from this point P to the circle's diameter AB, meeting it at M. Similarly, we draw perpendicular line from point P to its diameter CD, meeting it at N. Now, the question is, if the diameter of the circle is 10 units, what's the length of MN? You have 15 seconds to solve this question and your time starts now. Time's up. Please pause the video if you couldn't solve it yet and want more time to do it. Let's move towards solution. So were you trying to use Pythagorean theorem here? The thing is there is no neat way to use this theorem here. So we need to look at the problem from an entirely new perspective. Once we do that, we find that quadrilateral PMON is actually a rectangle. It's because the question mentions that the line PM and PN drawn from the point P are perpendicular to perpendicular diameters of the circle. This means these three angles of quadrilateral MNON are right angles. Which means all four angles of this quadrilateral are right angles, making it a rectangle. Now we know that the diagonals of a rectangle are equal. This means if we construct a line OP here, it will be equal to MN. And interestingly, OP is the radius of the circle. So it will be half of the diameter, which will be half of 10 units, which will be 5 units. And that's it. It's easy. Just that we needed a more enhanced perspective to look at the problem. Now, there also is another effective way to look at it. Because the question says point P is any point on the circumference of the circle, it might as well be at A. In that case, MN coincides with AO. Which is the radius of the circle, which is 5 units. Subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos. Like and comment for opinions if any. Thank you.